Okay, families, this is the bag that you will get. Um, it will be sitting outside the doors going into the gym um, where we meet every Monday. Um, there's an overhang, so it will not get ruined in weather, and I will have it out there by Sunday morning. So you can pick it up anytime Sunday, anytime Monday, and I will go collect anything left over um, on Monday night. Uh, this happens to be the Bennett's. Um, so uh, I just wanna show you what you're looking for. There will be a bag and it will have um, some basic minor, um, I'm trying to do this one-handed, instructions. Um, the bulk of your instructions will be in the videos on YouTube. Uh, you'll have one sheet of paper and 12 cups. That is for your tower. Now, I advise of the change in the instructions, but the straw towers were just um, a lot of straws. They, it was a little more complicated. Uh, Miss Elisa found a video that builds a tower using the cups and a paper piece of paper. And it very clearly talks about and demonstrates the importance of having, having that firm foundation. So you'll have those materials. Then you'll also have, um, I'm losing half of it here. Um, in the cup, you will find, I've got kids coming in and out of the house, sorry. In the cup, you will find, um, materials for your catapult. You will have enough materials to make one catapult per foundations student. So one catapult, you will need a spoon, you will need seven sticks, and you will need three rubber bands. One, two, three, okay? Now, once you build your catapult, and I will have that in a separate video, um, you will use this to put in your catapult to practice um, and to see how far it goes and make it fun. Um, do little um, contests with the kids and or the a, a kid and you and see who can shoot it the farthest. So this is what your bag will look like. Um, that's what you're looking for sitting outside the church Sunday and Monday.